audience. Mr. Osher, can you please uh, bring in the witnesses? Aye, Bajere Ture. 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 Do swear up. Ben Kalila Ko. Ben Kalila Ko. I'll speak the truth. Me tonya le fola. Me tonya le fola. The whole truth. Tonya dama. Tonya dama. And nothing but the truth. Ndun te fem fola me manke tonya ti. Ndun fem fola ya me manke tonya. So help me God. Oto alama alayende ma. Oto alama alayende ma. I Abdullah Sani. Nde ablai sana, nde ablai sana. Duswaida. Mbengali lako, mbengali lako. I'll speak the truth. Beto ni ala fola, beto ni ala fola. The whole truth. Tonya dama, tonya dama. Nothing but the truth. Adunte fem fola me manke tonya. Adunte fem fola me manke tonya. So help me God. Oto alama ala ndema. Alama ala ndema. I Alfuseni Ture. I Alfuseni Ture. Do swear that. Do swear that. I'll speak the truth. I'll speak the truth. The whole truth. The whole truth. And nothing but the truth. And nothing but the truth. So help me God. So help me God. Thank you. Good afternoon to you all. Altinya Albi. And welcome to the TRRC. And Albi similar TRRC, yeah. Mr. Chairman, as you can see, we are having a group uh, correction in today. Mr. Chairman, I come in this day no nyameng. Now, kafole sora janya ati lomar jang. Mulla msi edoldi. And uh, this three are going to testify with respect to one incident. Andu nyimo sabolve bese de aro di la ku kill nela for na killing. Um, the elderly one, uh, Mr. Bajere. Keba mani me mu Bajere ti. Due to health reasons. Will be going in and out of the hearing room if he feels like he should do so. For your testimony today, we are going to deal with a brief of your background. And we'll do so individually. As three of you are, are testifying at the same time. I'll 
I'll be directing the corrections to you individually. Just to avoid overlapping. And to ensure that the testimony is well tailored. And after dealing with your biography, we're going to talk about the incident that happened in Birkama in 1998. And we'll deal with the impact of the incident afterwards. Since uh, Mr. Baje understands only Mandinka, your testimony will be in Mandinka. And I understand that uh, both Mr. Sane and Mr. Ture do understand English. And there is a temptation of answering the question before it is interpreted when you understand it. I'll advise that you listen first to the interpreter before responding to my questions. Like I said, I will be directing questions to you individually. I hope you do understand. Can we start now? I'll start with uh, Mr. Bajer. Can you please state your name? Mr. Bajer, if I see Tony, condom for no more. Yeah, you were born. And we will send you some And where you were born. And you will remain to Elephana. My name is Jereba Ture. Can you please tell us the year you were born? 1946. I was born in 1946. Can you recall where you were born? I was born in Brikama. And where are you currently residing? I'm still at Brikama. Can you tell us if you have an occupation? Well, I'm not working nowadays because I am not feeling well. Can you tell us if you had always lived in Brikama? Yes, I've always stayed in Brikama. Thank you very much. Now we'll go to Mr. Sane. Mr. Sane, can you please give us a brief summary of where you were born, when you were born, and the year you were born in? Uluta on the 3rd October 1956. My name is Abdullah Sane. Uluda on the 3rd of January 1956. I was born on the 3rd of January 1956. And where were you born? Uluda Brikama. I was born Combo in, Central Western Division. in Brikama, Combo Central Western Division. Can you tell us what your occupation is? I was born in Brikama. 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 I was an accountant, but from 2004 to date, I am not working. Were you always residing in Birkama? Yes, I've always, always stayed in Birkama. Thank you very much, Mr. Sane. Mr. Sane. Mr. Ture, please, can you tell us your name, your date of birth, your place of birth, and your residence? My name is Alfu Seni Ture. I was born in Birkama, April 8, 1972. Now I reside in the United States. Thank you very much, Mr. Ture. Um, earlier I had told you that um, your testimony will be in Mandinka. I know you do understand English, 
but just for the purpose of um, having uh, the same language, or appreciate it if you give your testimony in Mandinka instead. Okay. So you will please uh, wait for the interpreter to interpret whatever question I put to you, then you answer the question. Okay. Mr. Interpreter, can you please do that? I come in for all the music, Mr. Alfusen Ture, I'm for Hamle, you have to go for Hamle. But I come in, I'm going to go to the world, I'm going to go to the world. Mbela fela puri ifanya safari na mandinga kwa risaje kumu kuli sio ning sisi dandi ro ning kule akuka na soraji ba saja biashi tiki kuki lumoti mbela fela wola tu alfu seni tu reality uluta piri kama sari kono kura april karo atili sisi 1972 wale sisi nte manta la sabati ring piri kama mesa sabati ring amerika le yo yakumu la nyoka nyama ngatari ya le kwa tu mu alfu seni tu reality uluta sangu ma Brikama sare kono April 8, 1972. I was born in Brikama, April 8, 1972. Wali sare nteng me sabatiri in America. But right now I am resident in America. Thank you very much, Mr. Sane. Abarka baake, Mr. Sane. Mr. Sane, can you please tell us what your occupation is? Mr. Sane, for yourself, for no mole, muna mwila do kodi. Mr. Ture. My apologies, I'm also getting confused there. Mr. Ture, alfu seni Ture. Scientist na doko mindi mu civil servant lele. Right now I'm a civil servant. Civil servant working where? Civil servant na yado doko la minto. Oh, me doko wala American ka doko ka company miye kafu ya parking management services. Um, I work for a company called Parking Management Services in America. In a sense, you work for the government. Amunta i o company ni ngalo masakunda le kono. Amantara manza kunda kuro ama afanso kompani yote. It's a company by itself, not under the government. So you work at a private company. Amunta ibe private dogo la kompani ni mu private afanso kompani la. Afanso kompani la. Yes, it's a private company. Thank you very much. Can you please give us a brief summary of your educational background? Isa afanso mule kumala suti ya kanga ila London yinga ala ala ila London yinga ala halo benyadi la. Uh, coming out from Uruta Brikama. Just as I said, I was born in Brikama. Uh, Uruta Brikama to Rekunda, to be precise. Then I uh, was born at Brikama to Rekunda. Uh, Karamo Kumasi, Karantal to follow. Then during Karamundo Dunwato Sita, in Dundi Karamundo 1979. I started my education at a madrasa, but later on, 1979, I was sent to a formal school. In 1979 to 1985, me become a primary school. 1979 to 19, 1979, I was attending the become a primary school. For 1985, Mutaji. And then I left there. 1985. That was Saint Augustine High School for 1990. I went to Saint Augustine High School till 1990. Very much Saint Augustine High School, menu Karanirola, become a junior school, saying. Wow. When I left St. Augustine's, I was a teacher at the Brikama Junior Secondary School, maybe. Yes, from 1991 to 1993. I taught there for three years, from 1991 to 1993. Then from 1993 to 1996, I worked as an NIA operative. Then be NIA, I'm by or be I'm by I'm by or I'm by private do call a private company, do. When I was dismissed from the NIA after three years, I started working at a private company. Me hold to for another time at America. That's where I worked until I had the chance to travel out of the country and go to America. Thank you very much, Mr. Ture. Abar kabake, Mr. Ture. Mr. Sane, can you please give us a brief summary of your educational background and your occupation as well? Mr. Abdullah Sane, if I don't understand, is it a Londonian na? Yeah, is it a Londonian na tariko? Is half ono mole ono baning muna mula do kodi. Okay, and then when I went to Brikama, I went to Brikama Primary School. I was also born in Brikama. I went to Brikama Primary School. 1966 to 1971. From 1966 to 1971. Then 1972 to 1975. From 1972 to 1975. 
Not at Latricunda Junior Secondary School. I attended the Latricunda Junior Secondary School. But I was to. When I left there, I started working at the Brikama Area Council. As a revenue collector. As a revenue collector. Then they sent me to GTTI. A one-year course out on accounting. I did a one-year accounting course at the GTTI. No, I was there from 1985 to 1995. Then I was there from 1985 to 1995. Then I then I got a job at the Bottrop High School as a bossa. Up to 2004. Up to 2004. Then I was threatened until I had to leave the job. From that time up to date, I am not employed. Thank you very much, Mr. Sane. Abarakabake, Mr. Sane. Mr. Bajere. Mr. Bajere, I know you do not have any formal uh, education. So we'll move to the next question for you. Can you tell us um, right around um, the year 1998 who the Imam of Birkama Mox was? Oui, ça fait non, il y a 1998 It was Al Haji Karamo Touré. Al Haji Karamo Touré, you said, was the Imam of Birkama Mox. Was um, that position in his family for a long time? Ko Al Haji Karamo Touré, voilà mon Al Mamouti nous. For what palace on in Tartabul and for what Jamba? Catarabul? For palace on in Tartabul and for what Jam? Ah, the palace out of for what Jam? My question was not whether the position was with him for a long time. My question was whether the position was in his family for a long time. Alla, for palace on in a baladimba bullet for what Jamba? Alla, family mole. For what is your palace? I don't have a family car or for what is your for what I mean. He was there until the time he passed away. Where the Turekunda family, the imams of Birkama, for a long time, for what is your for what is your for what is your for 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 what is your Yes, and up to date, they are the imams of Brikama. And during that time, Aladi Karamoture was the imam of Brikama, correct? What was it? Aladi Karamoture. At the time, Brikama was the imam of Brikama. Yes, he was the imam. Did that position change? Po palace was the imam of Brikama. Po palace was the imam of Brikama. No, it didn't change. I'll shift the question to Mr. Sane. Mr. Sane, the position of Imam that Alaji Karamoturi occupied. Mr. Sane, Alaji Karamoturi, the palace of Menta, the Alma Mayad, the Menta Bulu. Did it change? For another Nafali Naba. Another Nafali Naba. Yes, it changed at one time. Can you please tell us about that? In 1998, a It changed in 1998. Can you tell us what led to this change? What uh, brought about the change? There was a job which was to be carried out at the mosque. This job, the group who did the job was called Hyde Park to fence the mosque. But I was upgrade. 
it was fenced before, but now this time it was supposed to be upgraded. So now they all for Imam here. They, when they came, that's what they told the Imam. He said to them, that's very good. He told them about how the fencing came about, that's how you will do it. So I'll be now for Nasirullah and Kasidami. We will come all the way to the place where we used to sit down. That's where we wait for the time of prayers. And during the Ramadan, that's where we used to cut our fast. You pass that area. If you come up to the corner, you start fencing from that point and go along. That's what they were doing. They started the job. Another They came up to the point of passing that place. They didn't touch that place. Bring Imam Nata Tamos or Kataho Kunti. When the Imam uh, traveled all the way to Kunting, on a Saturday, because of his absence, I would just like to ask a few follow-up questions before you proceed further. You mentioned that a group called High Park approached the Imam to construct the fence of the mosques. Who were this group? They called themselves the Hyde Park Group. Did this group have any political affiliations? Political, political school, A political behavior? Yes, they deal with politics. Can you tell us about that? For is it for any other club? Moja, I believe the APRC. There are many people who are within the APRC party. Go ahead. Ten, ten. I moja be the APRC and they can participate in APRC events to back it. Those who are within the APRC party, they are a lot, and they participate in APRC activities. People like Ma, uh, Malang Aida Kata Keleng Wolu. People like Malang Aida plus Keleng and others. So when the Imam told them uh, not to construct at a particular place where they usually sit. During Almamoy Koeko, ni be loro le kana loro ke dinkira do mialon ko mol kasi damendo. What happened? Mune nata nake. When he told them that, one other time on Saturday, Kadavo Kunting. He traveled on Saturday and went to a place called Kunting. Being at that on Saturday, when he went on that Saturday, in order to see them adjacent, they came where he used to sit down. They dug that place. Ako e kano damensing. The place where he told them not to touch. Yeah, e konge concrete fengo fly loje. They decided to erect a concrete uh, 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 something there, a concrete moon. Yeah, they built that concrete in the middle and in Tonkongoto and at the corner. And uh, what happened after they built uh, these pillars there? When they erected these pillars there, also more Imam Nazana. The Imam came on the following day. Between Talan Saba and Salafanani Alan Sarotema. Between the two o'clock prayers and the five o'clock prayers. Another day. He came to the mosque. Another day called Akasida Molkasida Minuni. He saw that he saw that the people where they used to sit, these people had already erected these concrete pillars there. Yeah. Thank you very much. Baraka. I'd like to go back to Bajer. Can you tell us how the Imam found out that um, they had erected the fence where he told them not to? Bajere, 
When he came from his travels, <coughs> around lunch time, I was going home. When he came, I said to him, Ah, the place where you saw these people and told them not to put anything there, they decided to erect pillars there. Where you saw these people and told them not to put anything there, they decided to erect pillars there. He said, let's go via there, and I'm going to pull down those pillars. He said, follow me, and let's go. We went. I took a hammer from our workplace. We went and dismantled those pillars. There were, there were only two pillars. And their length was uh, less than one meter. We dismantled, we dismantled these pillars and left everything there for them. Can you tell us how many of you were involved in uh, dismantling these pillars? We saw for any. It was the three of us. We went to the house. Uh, myself. I Malan Khalifa. And someone called Malan Khalifa. And Ablai Sane. We were the people present. Do you know the source of the funding that the High Park used to erect that fence? In High Park, Kafoni. For you alone, you now depends on your sort of mental, you mean, you mean, depends on your how blinding fence. Yeah, I'm a tutifal. Yeah, I'm a tutifal. What is your deal? I'll let you. She gave them the check of $10,000. That's the money they used to carry out that job. Do you know if the Imam had asked them to go and seek for funds to erect this fence? For it is a long door. Almamo, for I tell you, you can put it up, the defense will not put it up in the fence all over. No. He didn't tell them that. So they approached the Imam on their own that they wanted to erect these funds from the funds that they had gotten from Tutifal, correct? Munta it will found kun ikuma it will found la miro it will imam walling ka fire ko lafta jamo nyin la fenso nyin lo lale kodo ro me alon ko ya soto nyin fe to Tutifal la nyin defensor. Ha. You mentioned that um, this Tutifal you're referring to is Yaya Jammeh's Tutifal. Who was Yaya Jammeh? Who was Tutifal? Tutifal. Tutifal. Yaya Jammeh is Tutifal. You know what Yaya Jammeh is? The president, the president, the ex-president who was here. And who was this Tutifal to him? In Tutifal, my mother, you know. Tutifal was his wife. Thank you very much. Barakabake, it was an end of Um. I'll move to you, Mr. Toure. Silambita, Mr. Alfuseni Toure. Can you tell us um, if you have any relationship with the Imam, for Mr. Kamo Toure? Mr. Alfuseni Toure, for your phone on your phone, body are sort of body are being Alma Moti, Alma Karamo Toure. Okay. Yes. Can you tell us about your relationship? He was my born father. 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 The high park approached your father with respect to constructing a fence around the marks. Bringing kafu e government high park, bringing e farm a walling. Eh, andum yindali lo kama ko e left fence ola londi la je jamor. Do you know how your father felt about it? Fo ida londo ro fo ida londo e farm a keta a kuni keta fe nyadi le. Ah, can you alone a keta fe nyami? Yes, I know how he took it. Parce que bien il colo samba na au bien la kibaro fa il co colo le soto il be jamais on a fait ça renouveler la volonté d'Aku 
when the information was given to him that money has been acquired to extend defense of the mosque ya ko kataare ni sare kebalu ka fo dolla birka maje sare kebale kansulo so ka fo mi bulunda they discussed it with other members of the elder community there is a community of elders called bulunda in brikama ya biriya ko kataje imamo when they discussed the issue imamo min gram fama da te min fo e wolom ka sini ndula min do alkanaje fenso futan nije the uh, my father the imam what he told them was that this place is the place where we used to sit down but please don't put anything there mana i can see them is part of the jamia wala fencing but the main more difference to the rest of the fence was bring fence on for je je you enforce concrete like they are flat like a bench or i can say a white table i didn't want to say molo well, part of the fence in border area you will flat in the area enforced with concrete the place where they used to sit the elders used to sit is part of the fencing but at the area was reinforced concrete and extended inside where they made just like a table so that they can have a place where to sit down this is how the place was constructed yeah me and uncle are coming down the table because you need to see that guy is going so i'm going to bench out i'm on high for now but you need to see that guy is going to bank home well the place is constructed in a way whereby it's not a table but people can sit down there and if you sit down there your feet will not reach the ground so according to that you are going to get fence because you can see jay like a salary what if you know but you i mean for now soon go on for now you can soon do okay world he told them not to erect anything on that uh, uh, sitting place because there that's the place where they used to sit down and wait for prayer time and also in the ramadan uh, most of the elders as normal as or as customary they cut their fast at the mosque and that's the place where they used to sit down and cut their fast and then you know assurance the other go imanta je mala imanta fenkela je and he was given the assurance he was assured that this place they will not touch at that, that place thank you very much mr ture i believe it's time for our break now and this is a good place to stop till we resume kamen fo wala nyinti ko jigita nyin a jigita nyin ko nyin nyin tembe da ci lono jande ngata na kontong la ni muruda na se dia mosina tenten mr chairman chairman duño webul uh thank you council barka ba ke council touré ko nan ko lal mami yade ay de sobindi but uh, uh we will take a one hour lunch break and uh, come back Uh, at 2:30 meeting is again
5 star just now, my just now begin again up here. Mom, the new tube, Palman, the gain of four, Mom, the new legay, uh, Bundeme Bamako, you lend them to Massi Birik Boop in the day date, the Nena Jasuni specs, Nele Nilin Kubuge, Nailin Kubuge, Fort B, Nangami Fort Lang Buga, Purmuna set. Wow, Tubi Skin Care did it, Doko Sol Mudila Taha all over the place. Chigatel, you like the tube. Dara do doy day des. Not only the new tube, but bulani he new tube alla, but pare nak nyaw alla. Nyaw film gina seti nak regla nyaw fully. Nyati nyaw kat leng am am ni nyaw kat di sample. Ngam ne you know kopo direct ba def sa taiba def sa dagit def sa roba amud ben daume. Am ne ko ham ne monyo daume daume jigen. Then am ne ta mit special nyaw kat bo ham ne nyaw igo regla nyaw defal. Ngabuga sa his and hers muy korete muy tobaski ba muy gente muy taka. Bangga bugarek, you know, def sa yeka buba ha ba ha ba. Dagul binyo skin care plus. Nyudim beli la tanal la chupam gina ba he. Def sa yeka gina for li. Ngane lan holbi bitakala. Skin care feel of legi ente. We not all about skin. We are skin care and the plus. And the plus does come in so many different ways. Miss B Designer Outlet is the number one quality and affordable stop shop for all your needs. Get your evening dresses, suit and ties, office wears for both ladies and gentlemen, beach wears, sport wears, pure leather shoes for men, quality belts, bags, heels for all beautiful ladies, original perfumes, accessories and a lot more.
Find us at Kolali New Road opposite Gaddafi Mosque at the Aqua Preacher Station or call us on 295-3411 or 764-2486. Miss B Designer Outlet. Shop right, look good. Do you live abroad and want to build your dream home in the Gambia without risking your funds and family ties? Do you want a household name that is trustworthy and efficient? A name that will continue to give you updates on the project from the beginning to the very end with videos and pictures? If your answer is yes, then worry no more. Boss Construction and Asset Management is here for you. If you live outside the Gambia and want to build your dream home, then this is ideal for you. Just reach out to Boss Construction and let's start building the dream home into a reality. With Boss Construction, the difference is clear. We give you value for money. Some of our services includes the following. Construction management, building equipment rentals, rent management, purchase and leasing, asset management and many more. For more information, please contact 282-4945. Better still, send us an email bossgambia at gmail.com or you can also visit our website on www.bossgambia.com Boss Construction, a name you can trust. Boss Construction and Asset Management, keeping families together. No, I didn't buy any more. <laughs> I'm not okay. Okay. Welcome, welcome. Uh, basically, lot of lala me along with school, man, that I can really relax. What the yeah, madam? What the madam? Let him do some money. Ah, that's right. Slowly. Yes, yes, yes. No, 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 yeah, actually, not to basically, me and I'm going to relax. 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 i am This is like a paradise. I know. 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 I know